Today, I want to share a tool to help you tap into your creativity and spark inspiration. A tool for nurturing your creative soul called the Artist Date. The Artist Date is one of two basic tools in the book The Artist's Way by Julia Cameron. The other tool is Morning Pages, which I've already shared about on my channel multiple times. In a nutshell, The Artist Date is a weekly solo date to explore something that interests you, spending quality time with yourself to nurture and fill your creative soul. I'd like to thank Canon for sponsoring this video and for creating amazing products that allow us to be creative, express ourselves, and share our gifts with the world. I honestly wouldn't be here without them. For my artist date today, I decided to explore my new neighborhood and capture whatever inspires me. I just parked on a random street and started roaming around freely. I brought my new Canon EOS M100, which is great for travel because it's so portable and lightweight. The EOS M100 is a mirrorless camera that takes beautiful images thanks to its fast autofocus, an advanced image sensor, and an intuitive interface. It also has the tilt type LCD screen that rotates 180 degrees, perfect for vlogging and selfies. There's also a fun feature called Creative Assist, which allows you to customize the look and feel of your shots. Check out the link in the description below to learn more about the Canon EOS. M100. The author Julia Cameron describes the artist date like this. Artist dates fire up the imagination, they spark whimsy, they encourage play. Since art is about the play of ideas, they feed our creative work by replenishing our inner well of images and inspiration. When choosing an artist date, it's good to ask yourself, what sounds fun? And then allow yourself to try it. After exploring the city, I went to a nearby garden to relax with nature. I find myself more inspired by plants and flowers lately, and it was all I felt like capturing today. It was also really fun to test out the camera in the setting, because to be honest, I felt more at peace here because there were less people around, less eyes judging me while I film. So I felt like I could take my time here and just be more creative. Finally, I found a cute, quiet spot to sit down and journal. I love journaling anywhere. In parks, at the beach, in airports, anywhere where I'm alone, basically. It's just so nice to sit down and share my thoughts of the moment, to just be present and document that feeling of peace. I also took this time to review my 2018 goals in my Artist of Life workbook, just reminding myself of everything I want to create with my life this year. I also took time to check out my bucket list and cross off anything that I've done so far. And of course, I wanted to document this moment on this cute bench with a selfie. I love that I could send photos from my camera to my phone via Wi-Fi. This feature is a must for me. I use it all the time. I 
hope you'll take this as a sign to start giving back to yourself. Carve out that one to two hours a week to take yourself out on an artist date and nurture your creative soul. Do something for yourself, just for fun. Let yourself play. Now I'm curious, what would you do for your artist date? Share in the comments below because I'd love to hear your ideas. Make sure you subscribe for more videos like this. Love you all so much and I'll see you next time. Bye!